This is a meeting from the Bureau of Land Management in Nevada, just a few days ago, 2017. Hi, uh, my name's Skipper, and uh, one thing I got a question about is uh, in 2016, there was a news article that came out that the BLM was selling land in Clark County. Now, why were you guys able to sell land? That's my question. Where's your authority and able to sell land when you are a management business, pretty much? Because it says right in your name, Bureau of Land Management, not land owners. That, that land was uh, part of the Southern Nevada Public Lands Management Act that uh, Congress told us that they kind of drew a line around Las Vegas and they said land in this area needs to dispose of. And so Congress gave us that direction. And so every year we go through two sales. Those sales are brought up uh, uh, okay. different municipalities, whether it's City Henderson or Las Vegas, North Las Vegas or Clark County, says these are the lands that we would like to have for sale. So we coordinate with them, we work with them, and then we put those up to auction and they'll mark it out. Who gets the money? BLM. Well, that money goes, uh, it's uh, 85% stays with BLM to be uh, reinvested back out. Uh, in fact, uh, several really nice projects have occurred uh, in the Muncieville area. We pay for it, we give them the money, so that we can manage that money. Uh, 10% goes to the Southern Nevada Water Authority, and then another 5% goes to the state school system. So what's the, what's the definition that, of public lands then? That is how Congress, that's what Congress told us to do as part of that act. But I thought Clark County owned the land. <coughs> Are we still into that territory? <laughs> sure. So we don't have a definition of what public lands is? Mm -hmm. Is it it's theirs, but it's ours, but they make it for it. My question is, 